Hello, this is Fake Chaos, and we are back with more uh, Final Fantasy XII. In the last episode, we went all the way through here to save Ash, and now our next target is going to the sub control room, then going through the whole starboard section to attempt to escape the ship. So, um, we will be going to do that now. And also, we gained Ash in our party for good, and we got all three of her uh, quickenings. So now we're slowly, we're surely completing our license boards. And yeah, so let's go ahead and get out of here. I believe whenever I did this game originally, whenever I got to the end of this place. I had already completed uh, Vaughn's license board, but that's because I stayed ho down here for hours and hours and hours just grinding them, so yeah. Majesty, we will cut to your path. I will not place my trust in the sword of a traitor. Yet trust his sword we must, traitor or no. I see no other way. We track back, commandeer a ship and make our escape. Her Majesty cannot abide weakness, least of all in herself. We must make her confront the reality of our plight. Alright, well, now the alarms are permanently on, so we will be encountering a lot of enemies shortly. But that's no match for us. Come on. We can, we can easily take on all of these enemies. Right, come on, let go. See, look at all these pansies. They suck. Just took him down with ease. Took him down with ease. Down and... Yeah, so if um, you wanted to grind license points, now is the time to do it. Because they are very easy to do, and the reason I didn't really buy any potions is because these guys drop quite a few of them. Alright, before we go into the next area, let's use Cure. And Vaughn. Uh, before we get in the next area, we have another hoplite after us. And see, just dropped another potion. Alright, well, um, keep going. All you do is just keep going north here. Into the sub control room. Sub control room. And see all the. And you can see all these red dots, and for some reason, they have UAV hacks so they can see where all of us are now. This guy's just fails so bad though, it's not even funny. Oh, we gain another chain level. Would you look at that? Alright, uh, get to this guy. And these enemies are just relentless. I think if you just stand here, they'll just keep coming out of nowhere. I'm not positive though, but after so long, uh, fewer and fewer of them start coming through. Or right, we go to our clan primer real quick, just to show you. We have a new thing in the Skyparts den here. Oh, it's, uh, Miguel. For selling over 1,000 pieces of loot. Oh, I usually don't get this till way later in the game. 500 foes, 50 chain in battle, 5,000 steps. Oh, and no, we had that last time. And this is the first one you'll get almost every time. Unless you just keep using uh, techniques over and over again. 
Alright, we completed the slaving thing. Uh, skull defenders. Uh, skeletons. Uh, Bogomnan. And the, um, we have regular Imperials here and the Imperial Elite. Which is that group of people we just killed recently. Alright, uh, let's see here. Where do we have to go? Alright. There is a switch panel up here, I believe. Wait, was there? Should be around here somewhere. And maybe we just go through the store, I'm not sure. Oh, we just go through the door. Alright, that works too. these guys and I just now noticed that Vaughn is pretty low on health but we're just fighting these swordsmen anyway so it's fairly easy here. Come on, come at me bro. And like I explained in an earlier episode after you get high enough uh, chain level um, some of these loots will actually heal you, which you just saw right there. And new chain levels, so now the loots will look even more different. And killing a dog apparently gets rid of your chain level. Alright, that works. Oh well, it doesn't really matter anyway. Alright, go license. Oh, look at that. And now Bosch can finally get 500 more HP. Alright, let's see. I know I look at the map a lot, but I just try to, try to uh, make sure I'm on the right path here. So it looks like we just keep running this way. And. Take the south path, and that path is blocked off, so we have to go all the way around up here. The reason we couldn't go back the other way is because uh, some of the doors are blocked off. They'll take us to the area that we need to be at. And it looks like we're being taken on from all directions. But it shouldn't really pose too much of a problem. Alright, just continue forward, um, take on this guy. Yeah. Alright, back in one of these areas, um, alright, I believe we have to go all the way south here because, uh, want the first area uh, it has a door blocking it, so we'll have to go all the way south, and who just came up behind us, so uh, matches. Alright. So, um, yeah. Go all the way down here. Uh, swordsman. Alright, and back up to this guy. Go for this guy now. Oh, and Von got a level up. He is now level 17. Alright, so Fran is only one under level 16. Or under level 17, I mean. So if you try to go. Oh, never mind. Or maybe it's, uh, if you do that. Hmm. I don't know, I'm not even sure. I'm just going to take this path. I could swear there was a reason why you couldn't take one of those paths, but I don't know.
Uh, let's kill this guy. Going up to this area here. <sighs> oh, what the? Gone. Didn't expect to see you guys here. It's okay. We're okay. Geese knows you've escaped. You must hurry. You are Captain Azalus. You will follow me. We must reach the airships before they do. You would let us leave knowing who we are. Lady Ash, by all rights you ought not even to exist. That you and Captain Ronsenberg were made to appear dead is like a hidden thread laid bare. Your actions hereafter will pull at that thread and we will see what it unravels. This is our chance. We must see this through and get to the bottom of it. I believe Tis for the good of Dalmasca, and the good of the Empire. Very well, then. Thanks, Lamont. Uh, I must apologize. Hmm. Penelo, for you. May it bring you good fortune. Thanks. Let us go. Okay then, we just lost uh, Vossler and gained Pinel. And you obtain a piece of manufactured nethocyte. The same nethocyte that uh, he threw at uh, Bogdanin for his escape. And Fran has, I mean, Pinello has almost 1800 license points. So she is the final member that will get the rest of those. Um, get the rest of the thingamajiggers and yes we just left the most expensive ones to get to just for her alright there was one somewhere else around here I don't remember where where oh where could that thingamajigger be alright we'll just buy our way to these ones, then I'll look for it. What time am I at here? 13 minutes. Alright. We have plenty of time to do this. I'll probably end up going a little over the time, though. A little over 20 minutes, because, uh, we'll probably have some more cutscenes coming up here. Oh, we don't want to buy that. Never mind. Alright, um... Well, there's 12 things of light armor. And then got this Genji armor. Alright. She has her first missed ability. Oh, and that's for the... Wait, I don't even know yet. Alright, I'll keep going here. 50 there. Alright. Try and take the cheapest paths, but every once in a while I have to buy, a, buy an expensive item to get there. Alright, and number two, Evanescence. That's a good band though. Oh, and here's the final one. If you guys have never heard of Evanescence, go look them up because it's a really good band. Well, I only like a few of their songs, but from the few songs I've heard, they're really good. 
I only listen to their older music though. Because I, I don't really care for the newer stuff. Alright, and we make it that far with, um, with 553 license points left. So, we'll buy some lures for just to power her up a little more. Because she really needs to be powered up. Because she kinda sucks. Alright, um... Gonna use magic mush, go for other since we use quickenings a lot. And that'll help replenish our things for those. Um oh while I'm at this, uh what the uh okay then. Um Oh we already have cure unlocked, okay. Uh what's some of these lures? Um Go for other lore too here. 150 HP. Uh, want to get swiftness, that helps out a lot. Uh, headsman helps. Pushing lore too helps out a lot. Uh, Phoenix lore helps. Um, what else? Ah, pushing lore 3. That'll come in handy. And another swiftness. Alright, and uh, what's this? Might as well go for that since we can afford it. Alright, now where are we at here? Alright, just go straight up and west. Straight up north and west after this, and then. Alright, before you go up here, what you want to do is um, heal everybody completely. Because, uh, and don't use magics because you want to keep that for um, later on. Uh, let's just go ahead and have Fran do this for everybody since she has a higher potion more here. Save us some potions. Or oh, wait, we have a oh uh, we have a high potion. I'll use that in Bosch. And that almost seals Bosch fully. We'll just top him off here. And then have Fran um Use more potions on Bond. And we'll also have uh, Bosch use more potions on Bond. Alright, just have Bond top himself off here and have Bosch top Frame off. Oh, that's good enough. Alright, now we are ready to go through here. And our last save was all the way back when we saved Ash. So if we, if you were to die here, you would have to go all the way back to that part and redo all of this, pretty much all of this episode. So yeah. I'll be a little careful there. Such a great shame. I must confess, I thought you the one who would help us restore peace to Dalmasca. No matter, we hold the proof of your royal lineage. A maid of passing resemblance will serve our purposes now. As for you, my dear, the Empire requires you no more! What was that? The Nethocyte. <sighs> your Majesty does not disappoint. Ever quick to spurn an honorable surrender, as was your father. You know nothing of my father! Yeah. 
All right, um, all right, my method with this and most boss battles is just to charge this guy, and as soon as you get up to him, quick aim, pyroclasm, charge geese. And I will stop talking while I do this. Thing that went just as planned, just pretty much one hit this guy. Well, more like nine him, but still. Killed him with one, uh, one quickening thing. Wow, this guy's old. We've secured an Atomos. Come! An Atomos? All skiff, no ship. Hardly fit for a leading man. So I can fly it then? You're mad. <sighs> Can't we go faster? Not yet. They've gone too fast, they'd have noticed. <sighs> Thea, your handkerchief. I thought you might want it back. I shall wear it close to my heart. Perhaps you forget all that Ondor has wrought. I do not forget, Majesty. It was by his counsel, dangerous though it may have been, that we were able to free you. You must meet with him, Your Highness, and give ear to his words. He may act in league with the Empire, but his heart is not. It is as he says. I ought not have kept Ondor at so great a distance for so long a time. I have played the fool. You were only being cautious. Majesty, I would ask you for some time. 
On our own, we struggle in vain to restore Dalmasca. I must search out some other way. Until I should find it, I would have Bash remain at your side. Doubt him you may. But I measure his loyalty to Dalmasca no less than my own. I know you would not speak so lightly. Very well. Keep her well. Go to Ondor and there await my return. Alright, I'm back now. Well, um, we finally made off the ship, and let's see where he took us to. Oh, uh, he just took us back to, uh, Bujerba. And we have to go over to the armor shop. But, uh, we are way out of time for this episode. 26 minutes now, so, um, I will see you guys in the next episode of... Uh, Final Fantasy XII, this concludes episode 20, so see you guys, uh, next time.